Hi, I'm Brian Weber. Welcome you to our Summer Games Technology and Business Report brought to you by Scott Trade. You are what you eat. The cliche applies to weekend warriors and elite athletes as well. It's a simple fact. The way we fuel our bodies affects our performance. Here's the latest in the study of sports nutrition and the latest advancement leading up to the Olympics. Basically, so we get the athletes in, we measure them, we test them. And then based on those results, we sit down with them and say, look, these are your strengths, these are your kind of opportunities to improve, um, this is the plan uh, that we uh, recommend. Um, <clears throat> and it is a little bit like, um, like a very high-end racing car that you bring into a garage and say, okay, this is my car, now can you make it faster? Well, first of all, I'm going to use every bit of information to my advantage. Uh, it's something that not many other athletes get to, to test out. I'm going to take it back to my, my team and hopefully uh, teach my teammates also some things about themselves that, that will help us be better as a team so that we can bring home gold. You could say, okay, what is different compared to the previous uh, 10 years or even kind of a five year uh, period? And you can see there are actually various kind of advances and the guidelines continuously uh, change. And I think what happened at the, the last meeting uh, was that the guidelines became much more specific. Whereas they were very general and they were the same almost for any uh, type of athlete, now we can be much more focused per uh, sport. Every athlete has gone through ups and downs throughout their career and the thing about sport nutrition that I kind of keep coming back to is it's something that you can control. Whereas so often in, in professional sports so much is out of your control. Why not, I mean logically, why not take advantage of the only thing that you actually can control and put yourself in the best possible position to win that game or to perform well on that field that specific day. And I think the, the future really is that we can take that one step further and really individualize it, make it very specific to the individual. Um, so that, that's where I think you know, nutrition will go in the future. Thanks for watching the Summer Games Technology and Business Report brought to you by Scott Trade, your home for online banking, investing, and trading. I'm Brian Weber. We'll see you next time.